I'm back here at Satellite Amps. Got another uh, question to answer over here on the bench. Uh, the question had to do with pulling a single output tube on a push-pull amplifier. What happens? Uh, so we have our single generator. We have our amplifier. We have a, uh, a dummy load back here. We have everything basically set up, and we have a scope. Get this propped up with the scope here. See. All right. So this is our output right now, unclipped. Trying to keep it a little bit clean. We're also going to do a clipped version in just a second. All right. So I'm going to pull an output tube uh, and let you know what we get. We have a little uh, bit of an interesting notch at the very top, uh, but not a huge overall difference. You know, wattage-wise, we do drop a bit. Uh, Sound-wise, it does change the sound definitely, but uh, I think that's a pretty good uh, indication of what happens. All right, so let me put the tube back in. Let it warm up. You can see the wave growing a little bit. All right, so if we get it into distortion here, a little bit of a clipped wave here. Uh, all right. And once again, I'll pull one more tube. And we'll take another look. And now here's where you'll see a big difference. The sine wave is still completely there. Uh, I mean, from a peak to peak standpoint, but obviously the curve has changed quite a bit. Uh, and the way that the amp will distort will sound different. Uh, not necessarily good, not necessarily bad, just different. And uh, I hope that helps. Thanks.